All right, Gary, we've got a gig tonight at the legendary Locomotive Hotel in Tamworth. Jimbo and Gary the Goat, oh yeah, they got the poster up and they've got titty girls on from fucking four to eight, mate. So, uh, good thing we got here early. Oh yeah, Gary, straight to the bar. We've got the girls and a naked goat, hey fellas? <laughs> Let's go with his foot. Mate, we're all falling That's apart, fun. aren't we? Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> hey, Gary, what are you doing? Get out. Gary, you Bit hungry, mate. Oh, he's into it. You seen many goats in here while you're working? <laughs> Gary, fucking hell, you're trashing the joint, mate. <laughs> oh, you want to have a bit of a punt to you, mate? <laughs> Fuck, Gary. <laughs> Gary, I know Cole Elliott's our competition, but no need to eat his poster, mate. That's not on. <laughs> Sorry, Cole. Gary, don't eat the tip board, that's sacred. So I'm just gonna go sit up for the gig, guys. We're doing dirty jokes out the back. Yeah. Can you make sure no one touches me, goat? I'll... Yeah. I can try my very best. Because with my goat, it's like you, it's a no touching rule no as well, okay? Rule. Yeah, yeah, can okay. I touch the goat? Yeah, you can touch him. Will you attack me? Before? No, no, you won't attack him, no. Are you sure? Yeah, no, no, he's, he's alright. Yeah. yeah. No, no, well, hey. He's no more scary than these guys, and you know how to deal with them, so you'll be right with the goat. No, just give him a pat on the back. Yeah, just down there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice work, Gary. Pulling a crowd, eh, mate? Yeah. Are you gonna do the, uh... What are you pulling, mate? Yeah, not, not Gary. <laughs> what are you, um... Well, you won't get much out, there's no balls. There you go, mate. Yeah, you want good. this ticket? Yeah, you got your tickets, yeah. What the fuck are you doing coming down to this show, you sicko, mate? Oh, I fucking love it, eh? <laughs> Cheers, man. Fucking Tamworth, how are you all? Yeah, fuck yeah. Apparently some guys drove from Narrabright. Where, where are you guys? Yeah, yeah. Stole a car and just fucking drove here. Yeah. And look at your eyes, how stoned are you as well, eh? <laughs> fucking cool. <laughs> You've been shelving pingers the whole way, really. <laughs> Yeah. What, up your ass or his? <laughs> you had an operation on your balls and you had a varicose vein wrapped around me nut. Oh, I've got five stents from the bottom of my heart to the top of my dick to slow the blood flow down. One there? Yeah. One there? Yeah. And one on top of my dick? Yeah. Oh. Well guys, we can't do this on a licensed premises. So what we'll do is we'll go across the road and we'll put a light on your balls. That's that one down there? So yeah. And then that one across there. Yeah, right. To take out that vein out of there. Oh, hey, right. screwed in his taxi. I said, you're right, mate. And he said, yeah, yeah, nah, I'm not. And he lifts his shirt up, Ralph's into his shirt. I lean over and open the door while we're stopped at the lights. He gets out, takes his shirt off, wipes his chops, throws his shirt in the ground, gets out, gets back in, not a drop on him. <laughs> it's a bit like an orgy. You want everyone to be fucking... Stand up, 69. <laughs> Slug, take it away. <laughs> you're just going, what the fuck's this show? And, yeah. Emily, can I do an interview with you? Yeah, but I can't show nipples. Yeah, I don't want, I don't want you to show my nipples. What do you I, want to interview you? I, I just, this is about your job here. That's like, my job. just go, yeah, cover your nipples, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, a lot of people don't, like, it's, oh, it's pretty cool, you just walk around. I love my job. Yeah, you love it, hey. Yeah. Well, if someone loves their job, what more do you want, hey? Nothing. And, Nothing you, and you fucking do a great job, all the Thanks. blokes are happy, yeah, happy. So and you chat with them. Because a lot of girls get a bit confused, they don't know what it's like, hey? It's pretty chilled out, isn't it? If you're good at it. Exactly. It's it's actually more, and I'm not just saying this, it's more than tits. You've got to be a girl who can deal with you the blokes. To, yeah, exactly. You have to know how to have a conversation with someone. Yep. Be able to like, keep talking shit to people, basically. Yeah. It's, it's a talent. Exactly. Yeah. Fuck. I can do that, but I don't have nice tits like you, so. Yeah. Well, that's great. And a lot of these blokes don't aren't near women in their workforce, are they? They, they not. They don't hang around women yeah, like. Most, not most, but a lot of them don't hang around women, so they get pretty confronted. But like, yeah. Out, yeah. Like, so they have a chat, but yeah. Up. And a lot of the guys are actually shy, aren't yeah, they? Yeah. A lot of them. Yeah, yeah. The majority of them. Yeah, so cool. Nearly every guy I go up to, they'll be shy at first, but I don't know you just gotta make them feel comfortable. Yeah. They're as nervous as you are. So. That's right. Yeah. It's the opposite of what people think. They think you're being intimidated, but you're actually loosening them all up. Yeah. 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 And have you and you seen many goats? Why, why? Um, only that. That's my first goat. Yeah. I've seen. Yeah. Yeah. Of course. Cool. Extraordinary. Yeah. Well, well, great. Well, Emily, you're doing an extraordinary job. Well done. I'd shake your hands, but uh, can't that, shake no, I can't because we can't show any tits on Facebook. 